Day. Day. It's got to get down. Yeah. Problem is if you pull it. Ben. That's what's happening. They're just pulling them slightly, coming over the top of them. They go just a couple of yards further. How far's that gone? Not even hit it. So he's got to aim this oh, 15 feet left and play around a wall. Hope it just falls down the slope. But this is tough. If he gets it within four or five feet, miracle. He's gone at just about right angles. Fantastic. Couldn't do better. Don't think he wants to leave the hole here, just inside the right edge. Great up and down. It's one of the very small minority that have two putted from that top tier. That's a great two putt. 245 to go. Cool. Yeah. Come on, is. keep walking. Well, he was taking no chances with those trees in front of him. Started it way right with a massive hook and that's a good break that's shot off towards the, the left hand face of the bunker which will make it an awful lot easier it's going to come up pretty high thank you nice okay. i think he was quite worried there about slipping down that slope but the feet did go a little bit but he's played it well he played it well does he get the birdie that's really good work, Tony, isn't it? Thank you. Yeah, out of position with the tee shot. He had to sling hook it. I'm glad this Here game is not all about power yet. You do need touch, finesse, stop. Stop, 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 course stop, stop, management. Stop. Stay. Stay. It's down in David Drysdale territory. Wrong club. Oh, he wanted to go straight and firm, pushed it a fraction. Just take a, a deep breath, Jamie. Three pots in the end, that's frustrating. One three six for Donaldson, pretty much the same yardage that McAvoy had, but off this fairway lie should get some fizz. Stay there, leave it, leave it, leave it, leave it. One three six the yardage and one three six is race to Dubai ranking. As you can see in the graphic. Now I think you'd be disappointed with that Tony from where he was, but there's signs that, that breeze is picking up. Early on, won't he? Try and hold this, but Sharply downhill, bit from the right. Not bad, not bad at all. He's shaking his head a little bit. Donaldson, of course, he's been there on so many occasions and well, he hit the winning shot at a Ryder Cup. I don't think you get any more pressure than that. So he's been there, done it, he's seen everything. So really down the left half of the fairway on McAvoy's line is a pretty good idea. It's pretty wide fairway at that distance as well. Sit down. Sit. Probably not out of this one, guys. An interesting Don, where he is down in the fairway, there's not much breeze, but up by the green, I can tell you it's blowing quite strong left to right, 187 all the way uphill. He's eyeing it up and down. His distance control has been incredible today. He's been almost absolutely flag high on all the shots. I don't think Jamie Donaldson's watching. He's got a nice putt here. Long way outside the right edge of the hole. Allowed a lot of break, but it needed it. Uh, He's looking anxiously. It was a well-balanced swing. 
quite a long way back, but it's absolutely fine. Today playing a little bit more across the hole, the wind from left to right. They'd be grateful that the flag is tucked on the right side. Almost wants to aim it at the left-hand bunker and drift it towards the pin. Go on, stay there. But in the end, he's hit it pretty much straight at it with a bit of draw. In exactly the same spot that we just saw Valamaki make that lovely chip from. On a slight upslope, with enough green to work with, and it's a peach. It's another player with a great short game. Wind's definitely going to knock the ball forward. It's certainly quite strong, good club strength right behind him at the moment. Skip it! It's listening, Jamie, it's listening. That's one of the best we've seen, if not the best so far. Yeah, and again, dead pin high, but this time he's got his direction right. Well done. And it can make a difference, even on putts of that length when it starts blowing that hard. That's a beautiful birdie for Donaldson. And 14 under par, and leader all on his own. Had a chat with Jamie last week. He's made some changes in his game. He's trying to play every single shot with a little draw. But Donaldson just a little left or right of here. Very, very makeable. It's a great try, wasn't it? Oh wait. believe that I, I can't believe what we're seeing Ooh. here that's the shortest putt we've seen miss this week oh, wouldn't you know it that's just what this game's all about isn't it you miss the shortest putt of the day the previous hole and then hole a snake does not also show you how good a space he is in mentally the trouble is this breeze is just gusting a little bit. It's not as if it's a constant, so can you actually trust it? Normally a very good wind player. Oh, you see, that's what happens. You see, look how that still the back. flag is when yeah. you get down there. It's sort of protected by the olive trees. Great short game. Good lie. Should scare the hole. Yeah, good shot. Yeah, nice shot. Nice yeah. shot, David. Good so much about mindset. I'm sure David Donaldson ran his putt past because from where he was putting, once you get on top of the slope, it looks like it's level. In actual fact, it goes downhill and left to right, so he's now got a right to left to coming back inside the right edge. You know, that's incredible because that's actually gone left to right and it shouldn't I think Warren's read was perfect there should have been just right half inside right and firm drifted yeah. away shot gone we've seen enough putts today to know that is the case really. well he should be eyeing this one up because he's got a lot of green to work with off a perfect lie Great spin. Be good. Seems to like it. Be good, he says. And it is. Bang on line. Quality shot from Donaldson. Best we've seen. Certainly of the, the last six or seven groups. <laughs> He was after it. He was ready to haul it out the hole. It was in. You know the golden rule, Tony, don't you? Never go for the early walk. But that was 
Incredible how that missed. Armitage has already played and gone down the right. I think he's taken over the right-hand bunker. Hard to see into the sun, but that's the shortest line as they play uphill. Big carry if you go left. 290 to carry the left-hand bunker. That's perfect. That's a cracking tee shot, isn't it? And you're going in with nothing more than a mid-iron from down there. Been really good with his distance control so far today. It's just trusting your technique, trusting your swing. It's what you've worked on all those years. Keep going. And he does get it. As we said, it hasn't been the best day on the greens for the Welshman, but that's right in the middle. Donaldson to 14 under. It's a third round, 69. Jamie, a day when you played the long holes in five under and the short ones in three over. Okay. Give us your verdict overall. Um, it was a lot of good stuff, uh, played great at the end there, the last few holes uh, dug in, uh, it was just tough, you know, the wind was blowing, like we were saying before on the course, um, it was, it was uh, blowing up to 20 mile an hour, so it made uh, a strong emphasis on flight control, wasn't able to keep a couple of shots down when I'd have liked to, we didn't have that problem the first two days, so it was a lot easier, it was a more of a shoot, shoot at sticks type thing, um, but overall quite happy. You've made nine cuts in a row, four top 15s in that run, so impressive form. What's behind it? Obviously the wrist surgery and you've got over that, but what is behind such consistently good form? Uh, don't know, just working hard really. Um, you know, I'm not getting any younger, so it's a case of just deciding what you want to do and I, what I want to do is to play golf. So, you know, it's a case of working really hard to get back to playing decent again um, and contending, which is, you know, what I'm doing now, which is great. So I was really happy with the way I've been playing recently. Uh, it's just a case now of getting um, match fit to winning tournaments again, which I'm doing, getting better all the time again. So, you know, it just took a long time after the wrist injury, really. Um, you know, you think it's going to be quite quick and, and it just took a long time. And even when I was back playing ready, you know, I wasn't ready, so, um, but you don't know that until now, um, and now it's good, so we just keep going. We've spoken already about the fact you're playing on a medical exemption this year, you're playing on an invitation this week. How big a sense of opportunity to change that for next year, which is the only way you can do that is to win, and you've got that opportunity tomorrow? Yeah, I have. Um, you know, like I say, played nicely today, I've played good for three rounds, so, uh, you know, tomorrow is the most important day so tomorrow is the day I have to produce my best golf I'm going to win there's a lot of guys up there um, you know I just need to go out there and play as well as I can play great plan today good luck tomorrow thank you thanks, thanks. to watch another European tour video click here and to subscribe click here